A very good morning to you children. Welcome back to your computer period. Myself Shabdika Pandey, your computer teacher and children. Today we are going to proceed our chapter number 3, chapter number 4 which is Microsoft Word 2010 and in this video we are going to learn that how to enter a text in a document, how to select a text, how to add a new text, how we can save our document and close a document and after this how we can open and print our document. Okay, so for this I am creating a new file and children we already discussed and we have already learned how to create a new file. So for creating a new file, I we have to select the file tab which is present at the corner of the window first we will select this file tab and go to the new button after clicking on this new button we will select this blank document okay now we get this new document okay now here what we have to do how we can enter a text so to enter a text what we will do we have to place our cursor Okay, we have to place our cursor, the place where we want the text and by using the keyboard, we can type anything given in a document. Okay, we can type anything in a document. Okay, for example, I am writing STEM field school. Okay, so by using this cursor, we can type anything in a word document. When a text we have to just place our cursor where we want our text to be and start typing by using the keyboard okay now what you have to do we have to press this button now children if you want to start your text from the new line you have to press the enter button after pressing this enter button you will come to the next line so that you will be able to type anything from the next line okay so to shift to the next line you have to press the enter button okay now next is how to select a text if we want to select any particular word or particular sentence how we can select it like suppose i am writing computer okay if I want to select this whole computer word, how we can select it? I am what I what I will do is I will place my cursor to the initial position of this word, like computer. Okay, so हमें क्या करना है हमें अपने cursor को अपने word के initial point पे जाकर उसको place कर देना. Okay, now after placing a cursor to the initial point. I will press my left mouse button and drag my mouse. Okay, what I will do? I will press my left mouse button and drag my mouse. Like I am pressing it and dragging my mouse in the word, over the word. Okay, after clicking, after dragging my mouse, my word will be selected. Okay, so this is how we can select a word in a document. If we want to select the whole paragraph or two line or three line, how we can select? We have to place our cursor to the initial point of the text and drag our mouse over the text so that our whole text will be selected. Understood? Now next is how to add a new text. So children, if we want to add some new text in between the sentences or in between the words, how we can enter it? So, for example, I want to add STEM field. I want to add international in between STEM field and school. Like what I have or what I wanted to write STEM field international school. Here, international is missing. So, how we can type this international how we can add this new text in a document so for this what we have to do is we have to place our cursor to the middle of the 
sentence okay so we have to place our cursor in between these two words like stem field and school so after pressing our after placing our cursor in the middle of these two words i will be able to write like i am typing international okay so this is how we can enter a new text in a document we can add a new text in a document so for this what we have to do we have to place our cursor to the particular place a particular space where we want that word and after placing the cursor we can type that particular word okay this is how we can add our text in a document Now next is after doing all our work, after completing all our work, how we can save our document? It is very important to save our document for future use. So how we can save our document? For saving our document, we have to again select this file tab. Okay, all the important uh, operations we can do from the file tab so for saving the document we have to click on this file tab option and after clicking on this file tab option we have to choose the save option okay click on this save option and after clicking the save option we have to choose the location location means लाइक like, हमें कहाँ अपनी फाइल को सेव करना है किस फोल्डर में या किस डॉक्यूमेंट में हम अपनी फाइल को सेव करना है वी हैव टू चूज दैट पर्टिकुलर लोकेशन फ्रॉम द लेफ्ट साइड लाइक आई वॉन्टेड टू एड माई सेव माई फाइल इन द डेस्कटॉप अगर हम मुझे अपनी फाइल डेस्कटॉप में सेव करनी है सो दैट आई विल चूज दिस डेस्कटॉप ऑप्शन एंड फ्रॉम हेयर आई विल राइट द नेम ऑफ द फाइल लाइक आई एम राइटिंग कंप्यूटर Class three. Okay. So I am saving this file with this name. Okay, मैं अपनी फाइल को कंप्यूटर क्लास थ्री नेम नेम्स के नाम से सेव कर दूँ. Okay, for saving this file, I have to. We have to press the save button. Okay, after clicking on the save button, our file will get saved. Okay, understood. Now next is. how we can close a document after using the whole document whole word file we it is very important to close our file so how we can close our file again we will go to the file tab and you can see this a uh, close option at the last we have to press this close option and so that our document will be closed okay now i'm not closing it right now but our document will be closed from that close option okay now children how we can open a document next topic is what how we can open a document open a document means how we can open an already existing document okay so for this we have to press again we have to go to the file tab and say click on this open option okay after clicking on open option we will click on browse option and after clicking on this browse option we will select the file like i want to open this file and press the open button so that our file will get open understood so for opening an already existing file we have to go to the file tab and press the open button and choose our file and open the file understood next is how we can print a document for printing this document again we will go to this file tab okay for printing the document we will go to the file tab and select this print option okay now from here what we have to do is we have to choose our the name of the printer from here here the various name of the printers are given we have to choose the particular printer and click on this print button okay after clicking on this print button we will get the print of this desired page the page you can see here we will get the print out of this page so children this is all for today we have done with the chapter okay so we will meet in the next class till then 
stay safe stay in your home and stay healthy everyone